Jake, I hope you brought your your rabbit's feet because we're talking about the lucky <laughs> origin feet. <laughs> well done, good sir. <laughs> lucky feet underwent some changes, actually. Uh, it was probably, if I think just objectively speaking, if you just take a step back, this is probably the best feet in the 2014 rule set. Just it, it I mean, the, this this thing affects everything and you, you could re-roll three of them in a day. I consider what they did to it a nerf. I think it was probably a good one. I think rogues are really, really, really going to love having the lucky feet because of the way it works. The new one, it basically, you can get advantage on a D20 test, which specific language. I don't know if we've seen the words D20 test in 2014, perhaps, but I don't remember seeing it presented in that way. But that essentially means it could be an ability check. It could be a... Uh, uh, an attack roll, you roll into d20, try and find the result. You could roll with advantage. Um, and also, if a creature rolls an attack against you, you can have them roll with disadvantage. And you have a number of luck points equal to your proficiency bonus. I guess you, you get a little more over time. Not a little more, you get almost twice as many over time. Can't use it as much, but exactly like you said, rogues are going to benefit from this greatly because it gives them another path towards sneak attack. So pretty significant in my book. Not dealing your sneak attack is painful as a rogue. 